this is a reminder that on Saturday, October 28th, Let's Play at Novora Autism will be hosting an Extra Life Halloween special featuring Undertale. Then, on Saturday, November the 4th, join us for our main Extra Life stream featuring Ukulele. Both of these streams will be supporting the McMaster Children's Hospital and the Children's Miracle Network. Come and show your support on both days for this wonderful cause. Okay, we're free to go. Off to the next boss, whoever it may be. How will he torment us? Whoa. Yeah, that's so deep of a fault you can't even see the bottom. How are we even gonna survive this fall? And apparently Ramsa is telling us all about the lore as we plummet to our deaths. And somehow land on our feet. Okay. Yeah. Okay, game. Yeah. I remember the Garam Scythe waterway from Final Fantasy XII. And it was nothing like this. Yeah. Into more water. Oh, we're swimming. Scratch lettering, huh? Yeah, too bad I can't take the time to read it. At least we know where to swim to. Pointless split is pointless. Whatever that means. Alright, so we join up with our friends. And once we're free to go... Okay, yep. A gateway opens, we're feeling a new route through the waterways. Skyrim ruins? That's what you're comparing this to? Oh, well now we're just getting washed down the river. Yeah, now we're just getting washed down the river. And it turns out we've made it to Lasalia. The Lasalia of Ivalisian legend. Lasalia, impossible! But what are we gonna have to confront? Yeah, some guy named Rofo Kale is gonna be our next opponent. I can only imagine how much fun we're gonna have with this guy. Quit not having fun. Um, I hate to break it to you there, Alonso, but I have not... I've been not having fun with this dungeon since I first tried it. This is the farthest I've ever gotten because I've never gotten past the first boss. Because people are jerks. And stupid. And don't know what to do. But at least we're being given an ample amount of time to be presented with information on how to do the fight. Or do I'm not your mom, don't be roadkill. Eight shaped AoE. <laughs> oh, we're gonna have tons of fun, aren't we? Has an alliance split, okay. Which is why we're all being encouraged to be sectioned off. Clean your room. <laughs> Alright. What does Rofokale have in store for us? Here we go! Yeah, who marches on Rofakale is the main? Me! A person who's a glutton for punishment and is likely gonna die in this first fight against you. Because if the fights against the two previous experts from Final Fantasy XII are any indication, this is gonna be a jolly good time! Because yeah, we can expect at least one wipe to occur here. Well, well, the chariot mech is not on me, so I don't have to bother running for it. And he does this move! 
Yeah, apparently he thinks he's Ilbert. Yeah, all of a sudden we're on Bellstar's wall. Whoa, run! Yeah, we're on Bellstar's wall, and this guy thinks he's Ilbert. Well, at least we're damaging him nicely. But of course, there's got to be ads showing up at some point to make our lives a living hell. And he wants to trample. Oh! Oh, he does a yeah. He does a fancy figure eight. <laughs> yeah. Not only does this guy think he's Elbert, he also thinks he's Paul Walker. Yeah, we've gone from Final Fantasy. We've gone from Bellsaurus Wall to the Fast and the Furious. Yeah, this guy is at literally a hum This guy's literally a centaur with wheels on. He's l looking at him, he's literally a centaur with wheels on because the wheels are part of his body. Well... And he wants to trample again. Which means staying in a place that's within the figure eight. But yeah, get off my case, man. Just waiting for you to do... What other fa whatever fancy thing you have in store. And he does this again. Sloppy! Oh, trample again. Um, okay, I can stand over here. Yeah, sloppy! Yeah, you know what else is sloppy? Half of group C, they're dead! Yeah, what else is sloppy? Half of group C, because they're dead! And what are you doing now? Yeah, I'll just join you guys. It's closer to the safe. It's closer to a safe haven for me as opposed to the other side. Because why not? Yeah, because why not? Oh, where you go okay, so now his friends. Um, I need to get to my group Because this is now like the final battle against the cloud of darkness in Final Fantasy or in the Crystal Tower So this is the cloud of darkness doing her thing against those Monsters that were part of that fight but Yeah, I have little belief that group C is gonna pull through because more than half their people are dead we can only watch on helplessly as this thing does not die in time and we're starting over. Yep, you maxed out, Rofakale. Not all the defensive buffs in the world aren't gonna save us. Where is he? Come on, finish us off. You maxed out, and apparently you have Orsight too. And you just wiped us out in one fell swoop with 295,000 points of damage. And I think there's still three more levels beyond this. There's still three more levels, and we've been at this for an hour. Yeah, where are you doing? Where are you doing, sloppy? Where are you doing, sloppy? Man, these things are too close! They're still on top of me! They're just for chasing me like there's no tomorrow! Okay, figure eight. Deal with the figure eight.
Where are you running? Uh, this way! This way! And unfortunately, a black mage froze and paid the price. Well, I know it can't be easy for you to play this game, Winter. But yeah, if you have to take a break from it, take a break from it. Not me, though. I can't be satisfied until I see myself finishing this place. I mean, I know I still have an hour to get the job done. But given how things have currently been going, given that we've wiped at least once to every boss at this point... Oh, crap. Slope! Loop run! Alright, back on him. Back on him. Back to running from AoE. Where is it going? This way! This way! Oh, and apparently you've added new fun! Apparently you've added new tricks. And apparently that black mage still doesn't get it. In that one black mage in group A still doesn't get it. It's not going to do you any good just standing in the center there, dude. Your services are needed. Where's group B's? It's this way. Well, thankfully this time group C has a full party. So I might have a chance here, if I don't get run over. But yeah, you have to avoid the Archeo Demon's AoE, and you also have to avoid Wofokale doing this! Well, we survived, but is 83 enough to survive? Group C has half its people dead again. Yeah, don't r start raising people until Mr. Rofokale here does his fancy maneuver here with the Aura Sight. And we endured. I don't know what channel is, nor do I care, the Rofokale. Right in the lane's embrace. I'm already writhing. Oh, are you doing the fancy drop stuff mechanic again? That, that we've seen in other battles? Oh, maybe you were, I don't know. Slope! Dark circle phase? There's more to it? Oh, wow, that didn't take long. Slope! Oh, and now you have new tricks! <laughs> yeah, we're playing Pop and Circumstance. Ooh, yeah! Yeah, Macho Man Randy Savage time, apparently. Yeah. The, the Macho Man is getting his ass kicked by a mech by a walking giant named... Rufo Kai, who thinks he's a chariot. Ooh, yeah. Oh, no! Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm somehow not dead. That, that, like, I had, I was right flush in the middle of the AoE and could not move. I was supposed to be dead. I was supposed to be dead, and yet somehow I miraculously survived. I somehow miraculously smart. Ooh yeah, run, run. Ooh yeah. Good thing I have you at my disposal. Was oh, this the uh, thing you were talking about? It is the thing you were talking about. Can I contribute? The tip of my nance is that already your, at your next submit or die. 
Um, I'll pass. Thanks. I'll pass. Thanks. I mean, I've already been in here for an hour. The less suffering I can endure, the better. And I'm not going to be inclined to use my triple limit break because, of course, that has to be used by the healers. Oh boy! Oh boy! This time, thankfully, I am not cut in the bind. This time, I'm not cut in the bind, and I see where you're going. Yeah, I saw what you're doing. Oh, well, that's slope, eh? But so is what I did, walking right into that. And thankfully, I am just on the very edge of that move. Now, I'll, I'll step over here, thank you. I'll step over here. Don't mind if I do! Slope! We've got him down to under a quarter now. I mean, we're, we're doing a lot better than we did before, but we're still running away from AoE! Okay. Yeah, you're doing this Dark Gias thing. It's not Code Gias, but... The code here is to... Turn off the circles. Where are you? Oh! Well, good thing I saw you move. Good thing I saw you move before it was too late. Thankfully, you're re you're losing strength in numbers, Ropakale. You used to have four of those. Now you would just have three. Oh, gotta run from this shit again. Which also means running behind into the figure eight hole. Oh, wow! Oh! Slope! Oh, turn around, turn around. I'm only gonna use this if I were at 5%. If we can get him down to 5%, I will then go ahead and use it. I think. But it looks like someone else already is. I can't tell. All right, it's on me. Well, thankfully... Oh, you knocked me out of it! What?! You knocked me out of it! Oh, shit! No, I'm dead. It's worth it to me! Yeah, I don't regret that. I don't regret using the triple limit break to get us the win. Yeah, to die a good death indeed. I am proud of myself for doing that. And apparently... We're not done? Wait a minute, oh, is this like a two-part bo final boss like we've seen before in... Um, Dunscape? And who are you? Well, whoever you are. Oh, you have Oarsight too? Promise you'll wait for me, guys. And you're gonna do something to yourself. And it's not gonna be pretty. Disturb the slumber of Argath Adalfos, rightful king of Ivalice. I guess that'll be us. Descendants of House Beowulf? Then by my sword shall I banish your souls to the deepest hell. I think you got me mixed up with someone else, buddy. Alright, so it's gonna be a two part final boss. Okay. Let me go to the final battle. Going back to start. And warping ourselves to the penultimate match. No, they're saying we're here now. This is the final boss. Be careful with lots of AoEs here. Yeah, no kidding. Waiting on a few pl play sign means to keep moving, not separate. Red eye mask actually. White mask equals truth, blue mask equals do the opposite.
I guess I'll just pass on these two things. Because I can't play for them. I already got what I needed, a piece of Dragoon gear. But it's not going to be used by me. At least not as far as I know. But I'll have to compare it against what I'm currently wearing. Spin Glove will make you point in direction it's pointing when you start. Kind of annoying. But yeah, what all we are tormenting ourselves with? And to all the people who are currently watching, thank you so much for coming to join us and watching me get tormented in this place. Please click that like button if you enjoy watching me getting myself tormented and tortured. Like, there's only four likes right now, but there are 17 of you currently watching. Smash that like button, as the Brits say. SMASH THAT LIKE BUTTON! LET'S GET TO 150 LIKES! Because, yeah, they, they seem to think that 150 likes is a decent threshold. So, yeah, smash that like button so we can get somewhere close to 150. I hate that bit. Well, so far, I've been hating all of it. Be careful if you, with your placement if you have a set of shaped swords above you. Um... Only our tank cannot answer that they're ready. But they're clearly here. They're clearly here, and we have 53 minutes to kill this guy. Yeah, to think that people actually torment themselves on this place. Yeah, I'm definitely breaking this video up into two parts. Happy to Here we go. Final battle against Argoth Podolphus. Whoa! And keep running! Keep very much running, still running! It could! Go! Oh! No! Way! But unfortunately, I cannot do a proper Chris Berman impression. Oh, hold st This is- they said hold still? Alright. Yeah, they did say one of these was to hold still, so... Yeah, I guess that was stop moving. Okay. Well, this is certainly interesting final boss music, for sure. The gods have no eyes for chattel. Um, uh... Oh, it covers the whole field. You can't do anything when it covers the entire field. The the oh, run. Oh, run. Oh, now that... Okay, so the... Yeah, originally the circle mech that was showing up before... Apparently it's used here. It's not back overused that Ropakale. Okay, I need to move. You will be judged. And we're fine. Kneel and repent. No! Yeah. AoE on all sides. And oh, I should probably run. And what? Yeah, hold hold position, hold position. Then run over this way, try to take as little damage as you can. Misery, you have been completely filled with misery for us. You've died more than anyone else in this group. I'm the only non-red mage in our group. And somehow, I've died less than you have. And as someone who's made it as a Dragoon, that's saying something. Oh, do we all have to go over here? Oh, we're killing stuff. We're killing stuff. We're killing stuff. We're trying to avoid AoE. Killing stuff and trying to avoid AoE. We're trying to stop these things from unholy sacrificing themselves. Does it grieve you to see the depths of your own weakness laid bare? Maggots. Oh, we've been maggots at this point. <laughs> Shard of Emptiness, is this something... It is something we need to fight. At least I think we can. Okay, you can damage it. And there's a meter, once again, because every boss has had a meter in this place. 
And I mean every boss has had a meter here. These bosses really like their ether meters. Oh, that one over there! Okay, you we stopped it at 80. And ultimate attack! We survived it. While you're all here, I'll get you to uh, enjoy my battle lit me. That makes no sense, dude. I need to run. You will be judged. Um, what? The world has no okay, I guess I got lucky. Oh, uh, no, I got turned into something else. Okay, I got turned into a chicken, then I got turned into this, now I'm standing in AoE, and I'm about to die. You are the blood to stay in the circle. And now we're gonna start dropping like flies. Because once again, Seeds Heaters are both dead. Whoops. Whoopsie, you, you have my utmost sympathies for having such terrible healers. You guys have sucked so bad. You have a blood to stay in the circle. Poor C healers. And poor group C for that matter. Having to be on the receiving end of such terrible healing. Meanwhile, my group doesn't even know where I am. Well, Cleo apparently found me. Insta death, what? You will be judged. Eh, don't judge me yet. I just got back on my feet there, dude. And we've only just now got him to half health. I am a revelation. But yeah, he apparently likes to keep spouting his rhetoric. Okay. I'm running, I'm running. You will be judged. The word? And the word is that I'm temporal. Oh, he, 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 they talked about this, but I am nowhere near safety. Oh, crap. Yeah, maybe I'll be lucky and I'll get to actually move over there. Yeah, not a chance. And now AIDS healers are dead. That sucks. Yeah, there was no way I could control where I was going. There was none. Yeah, how are you supposed to defend yourself against that? Seriously. Also, how come he hasn't spit out more ads yet? Oh, I don't have to. I don't think I have to worry about this. I do have to worry about this, though, because it's gonna keep pursuing me, and everyone else, for that matter. No! 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 Oh, I gotta move again. Stay close to the guy this time. Just in case he decides to mess with me again. Yeah, just in case he messes with me, I think I'm gonna want to stay close to the center this time around. Okay, stop moving. Stop moving. No, thank you. And now it's all eight parts are AoE. Okay, where is this stuff going? It's going that way. I need to get over here. Then I need to run this way and run into that unknowingly. Because why not? And I'm stuck like this for 30 seconds. A's healers are dead again. I'm dead on this AoE again. The world 
Thankfully, it's a good thing red mages can raise. So essentially, you have five people who can raise. No! No, no, no! Alright, at least I know where not to stand. At least I know where not to stand. He's down to 20%. Come on, come on. I just want to get there. I just want to be done. Where are you going now? Oh, I need to run, but staying close. In case. Yeah, just in case he decides to be cheap. What's he doing next? Gotta move again. You will be judged. It's weird how sometimes I'll take damage and sometimes I won't. Oh, this move again. This time I should probably be aware of my surroundings. Oh, he's not going anywhere. Oh, he, now he is. Alright, I'm on the right side. Just stay in here and you'll be fine. There. Ten to go. Or eight to go now. People are starting to use their limit breaks. I will soon do the same. In fact, I'll go now. Let it loose. Down to three. Down to two! Down to two, down to one. Just get it done. Just get it done so I can finally go home. Oh, yeah, mages, if you want it, you can have it. There we go, I'm finally done with this place after never getting past the first boss. This body, it is not my own. Oh gods, what have I done? Save me! Ramza! Save me! Apparently the mask is getting separated from everything else. But at long last, we're finally done. Thank God. Oh. After 75 minutes plus, this nightmare is over. I can finally find out what happens next. I had terrible rolls on those three pieces of music. And the cards work much better. But thank god, after nearly two weeks, of never getting past the first boss, I have finally beaten the royal city of Rabanaster. At long last. Oh, wow. This nightmare is finally over. So, after our victory, hard fought and well learned, we found more Aurasite. Meanwhile, yeah, who's this who's stumbling towards us? Yeah, look of shock on our faces. Uh, it's Genomus. Uh, where, where am I? Father! Ramza, and the Warrior of Light? Yes, I know of you, but that you should come to my rescue. 
Words fail me. A poor playwright I must seem. Oh. But all of a sudden, yeah. The poor guy now has a knife to his throat. Yeah, it's these guys from before, I'll bet. Yeah, laughing at us. Ah, uh, but Gamnin, the bounty hunter who constantly was trying to stop both Fear and Fran. Yeah, I remember you. That term you're looking for is thank you. Upon which note, I, Bagamnin, Bounty Hunter, do humbly thank you, Warrior of Light, for delivering me this fine gift. Now, hand over your sight, unless you wish to see the desert sands turn red. And be quick, Gijuk here does not have the steadiest of hands. That one! She will bring it to me! Oh, you're gonna put this on her? Yeah, we're complying. He was like, do I have to? And sadly, young lady, unfortunately, you have to. Yeah, she's looking around like, there has to be another way, right? Yeah, snatches it out of her hands and she just runs for it. And obviously he likes what he sees. But what was that red X on the stone? Yes, this is it! The Duma! And to think we found it so close to Doma! The Duma of Doma! <laughs> Yeah, you got what you were looking for. Um, yeah, I was gonna say, you got what you were looking for, but buddy, I don't think you were expecting to get shot in the gut. Enough, Froggy! We would not have our guests think us under bread! <laughs> yeah, so much so you shot your own guy in the gut. You have what you want, you thieving lizards, now unhand him! Of course, a banker is always true to his word. I will be keeping this, though! A book? Well, it's gotta be worth something if you're keeping it. And throwing gen Genomus asunder. And there's your means of escape. You've only yourselves to blame for this, but miss. But if you miss like the thought, you can always blame the gods! Not that they're listening. <laughs> Get up, fool. We're leaving. Yeah, the guy you shot in the gut. Apparently, he can take a couple of bullets to the gut. I guess they must have some pretty tough skin. If they can take two... If he can take a double-barreled handgun to the gut... So anyway, they've escaped, and we're obviously going to have to deal with them the next time we do a 24-man raid. You're going to be alright. We cannot see to your father's hurts here. Come on, we must get him back to the Prima Vista. So, upon our return, we'll go ahead and speak with Lena, and as we can see, Alma is not exactly happy that her father is back because he's in such bad shape. Lena? Genomus remains in deep slumber, but his breathing is steady and his fever has subsided. For now, all we can do is wait. I've sent word to Sid. I hope you don't mind. Not at all. Might as well bring him back, so he can at least positively ID the guy. Yeah, we're on our way out of Rabinaster, I guess. Gotta go find Sid again. Yep, 
Yeah, he's coming around. Man, we need to get her some tissues. Alma, Ramsa, can you ever forgive me? And you, Sid, it was never my intention to put you to such trouble. I am ever in your debt. You would have done the same for me, Genomus. Besides, it was Corinne here who went to all the trouble. If anyone deserves your thanks, it's her. I did what I could. He is right. I have done naught to deserve your kindness. Yet I am its beneficiary nonetheless. See, I guess we're gonna talk for a while. Let the man recover. So if I understand correctly, you're saying Orsight does not work to facilitate the possession of a living host by an icon, as is assumed to be the case with the sale and the Archbishop but rather absorbs the host's aether, its very soul, and somehow transforms it before returning it to the host's body. If that is all the case, our Charlian allies will need to be formed immediately. But I suppose the real question is, what did you come here looking for? The legend that would have us believe that the Lita Harial, the commoner who would be king, was the sole hero of the Zodiac Brave story. But as I have discovered, there was another. Two others, in fact. Siblings whose roles faded from subsequent retellings of the story. A brother and sister by the names of Ramza and Alma. Don't tell me you actually brought in the people who actually were part of that story. I took them as your own, and adopted them. To prepare for this assignment, I pored over every published work on Ivalisian legend I could lay my hands on, and nowhere did I find any mention of these siblings. I'm like, ah, But I did. I discovered irrefutable evidence that Delita had a close companion named Ramza who aided him in his rise to power. This in turn led me to Alma, and then that I might never lose sight of the truth, I named my own children after these lost players. I'm sorry I never told you any of this, Sid, but you must believe me. Ivelisse has been never a mere pastime of mine. It is, and forever will be, my calling. My purpose. My family's purpose. Go on. The world knows me as Genoma Sen Lexentale, yet that is but my stage name. My true name is Arislam, Arislam Durai. Countless generations passed, it was my ancestor who penned the Durai papers. An account of Ivelisse in the War of the Lions that details what truly occurred during that turbulent era. Yeah, elaborate. You are tired, Father. Rest. I will continue. Oh, you know what he's talking about? Long ago, an orphan by the name of Oron Durai crossed paths with both Ramza and Delita. After Delita's rise to power, Orn found himself in the service of the Papa become king. Following the War of the Lions, Orn believed the people of Ivelisse had a right to know the truth of Ramza's involvement and set about documenting his deeds. When the church learned of his intent, however, they had branded him a heretic and had him burned at the stake. Ouch. Joan of Arc style. The Durai papers were never published and any existing copies were gathered and sealed away in church vaults. The truth about Ivelisse being along with them. Almost likes we have an Ish Guardian story on our hands. What was so damning that it would drive the church to do such a thing? Guess they took a page out of Ishgard's book. Oh, you have a book too? 
The answer to that question can be found in this book, the only surviving transcript of my ancestor's chronicle, copied from early draft and pa passed down for untold generations. With this, my father and I plan to reveal the truth and restore honour to my family's name. Forbidding Chronicles? A secret family legacy? Not that I doubt you, Genovus, but how do you expect to convince people of all this when well nigh every soul in the realm believes Ivelisse to be nothing more but a bedtime story? So pro by proving that is anything but. And when people see that Ivelisse was real, the rest will fall into place. Were it as simple as bringing forth the Chronicle and submitting it for a view, we would of course have done so long ago, but alas it is not. The Darai papers you see are written in High Ivelisian, an ancient tongue long extinct. My father, his father, and his father before him, laboured tirelessly to decipher this tome, but for want of other sources on made only fit for progress. A word here, a phrase there, it wasn't until a recent expedition to Rabanasta turned up several well-preserved artifacts that we were able to translate a small portion of the papers. Then the diary stolen by the Banga bounty hunters? I'm afraid so. Everything we had learned of the language was contained in those pages. Then we're back to where we started. Not necessarily. We still have the transcript as well as some few translated passages. And of course, my father's impeccable memory. I have come too far to allow so simple a setback to deter me from my purpose. I will show the world the truth if it is the last thing I do. And we'll be along for the ride, as painful as it may be. It is, a, it is as Master Garland said. He is a man obsessed and I fear even his grip on him will only grow tighter. Father was fortunate to escape Robin Nasta with his life and already he speaks of continuing his quest. Promise me you will keep him safe. Please. I'll do what I can. So what are we going to be looking at? More Orosite? Oh, this Orosite's really going to play a role, isn't it? But at least we get to go back to Kugane. It'll take us a while to get back in, but once we do, we'll be able to speak with Lena as night has settled upon the realm. And so we'll speak with Lena to complete the challenge. After what I've seen here, I'm all but convinced that Evilly exists, at least in some form. The problem with gathering sufficient evidence to convince the thousands of scholars and historians who have based their careers on the presumption that it doesn't. Not that I've ever been one to shy from a challenge, especially in what means the story of the century. If you're in, Corinne, then I'm in. If you're not in, well, I'm still in. Either way, you'll be hearing from me again soon. That much I promise you. And so with that, 7,500 gil comes our way, plus two brand new songs. The protagonist theme, and the background story. Stand strong and unified! <laughs>